Hey there everyone, welcome to Tecmo Super Bowl on the NES. I was planning on doing Back to the Future Part 2 and 3. I couldn't get the game to work so I just I destroyed it. So we are starting with the 1991 games. This game actually has all the teams, uses the full team names too. Last game we just saw the cities. Oh, look, there has Peanut. But yeah, last game had the city names, but it didn't have the actual team names. It did have the players in it. The version we saw, downloaded on the Wii, didn't have the player names in it, it just had the numbers. This is the actual cartridge here. So, we're going to see the. This is the original Tecmo Super Bowl. Okay. So as you can see, most of the Tecmo games, are, Tecmo football games, we're going to see after this is going to have a menu pretty similar, almost identical to this. You know, background colors are going to be different, of course, but. You know, it's going to have the options to choose preseason, season, Pro Bowl, it's got team data. So, there's all the teams. These, these are the teams that were in the NFL at the time. As you can see, there were no Jacksonville Jaguars or Carolina Panthers. And some of the teams have different helmets, like the Patriots. Got the old helmets. Tampa Bay Buccaneers, they got their old helmets here. But anyway, go ahead and do a preseason game. I'm also going to be doing the full season, full season, but that's not going to be until I'm done with all the games. I'm going to do a full season of Tecmo Bowl, which is going to be kind of hard because they don't have like a normal schedule. Like, take a look at this. This has the actual 16 week schedule, 17 week, including the bye. So, in this game you can go 0-16 and they're still going to have the playoffs at, afterwards even though if you're 0-16 you're not going to make the playoffs, but you can still go ahead and watch the other teams. Whereas in the original Tecmo Bowl, I think you have to win every game to move on to the next one. So, I'm going to pick the Packers and for my opposing team... I think I'll make it an inner division team. Oh, maybe I'll make it against the Raiders because that's who we, I played as the Raiders in the last game. So this game I'll play against the Raiders. And in the future, we're eventually going to see the Packers play against the Bears and the Vikings. Now, the Lions and Buccaneers really weren't too big like rivalry, so. So Chris Jack was our kick, kicker back then. Okay. Got more plays in this game as you can see. Last one only had two running plays and two passing plays. This one's got four of each. This game's got Bo Jackson and Marcus Allen in it. Oh, look at that, I'm running, I'm running on the crowd. I remember when this game first came out, I was just amazed. But it hit, mainly because it had the Packers in it. I was just playing the original Tecmo Bowl, which didn't have them in there. Yeah, 
Yeah, see, I can't bring up the menu in this one like you can in the future games where you can change your players and all that good stuff. This one I remember, like 20 years, like from 20 years I still remember that. A lot of those game, old games have that, that music in them that it's like impossible to forget. What's he throwing to? Fourth down, I'm going for it. 
fourth and two. I gotta get the fifty. Got it. Yeah, I had to get rid of that quick. I don't like these plays. I'm used to Techno Super Bowl 3 where I can change my plays if I don't like them. I'll go with this stupid play again. Sterling Sharp. Wide receiver, what's he doing? He's running back. score in the next three seconds. Got a guy wide open and he's throwing it right to him. Oh, it's not. Regular Tech Mobile didn't have fumbles. Whoops. You might notice I run close to the sidelines a lot. That's because I'm used to playing the future games. And I do that in case I fumble. Out of bounds. But anyways, that if I fumble on the right at the sideline, there's a 50-50 chance it'll go out of bounds or the ball will be dead. I think I want to be punting. Yeah. Oh, it's only third, third and twenty. Anyways, if you fumble in the middle of the field, it seems like the other team always recovers it. Yeah. 
gun safety on this game. Last game he couldn't. scenes they do on the show like interceptions and blocks and stuff like that. in my life, that's Sterling Sharp jersey I've had since, like, 1993, somewhere around there. Still have it. Looks a little raggy right now, but still wear it once in a while. Techno games, they keep taking time outs towards the end of the like half and the end of the game. It's really annoying. See, I don't know why they're why the Raiders have been doing so many passing plays. And they're running, they got a really good running game. There's the timeout again. Touchdown before he even was in the end zone. Jaden 
kick it like upward or down with the knee drum by pressing up or down. I actually never knew that in all the years I've played these techno games. I never knew that until like maybe a couple of years ago. Seconds. Can I get a touchdown pass? Raiders. Rushing air, they only had 157, they had 203. If you look at the passing air, they had 221, they had 27. So how many is that all total? We got 378 for me, 230 for them. First downs, I let them 11 to 4. 17 times rushing, they had 7. See, that's pretty bad. They had 7 rushes. I mean, they're a really good team. They only had the run 7 times. And there's their leading rusher, Michael Haddix. I've never even heard of him. 78 yards. Marcus Allen had 5 rushes for 119 yards. Passing Damakowski 53%, Jay Schrader 14%. See, their passing was terrible. They were much better rushing. They probably would have had a good, good fighting chance against me if they had. They've gone for more rushes. Receiving Perry Kemp, Mervyn Fernandez. Tecmo Super Bowl on the NES. Next football game we're going to see is going to be Tecmo Super Bowl on the Super NES. Actually, before we see that, we might actually see another football game, Super High Impact on Super Nintendo. But anyway, before we get to the Super Nintendo, we still have some more games coming up like Princess Tomato and the Salad Kingdom. Simpsons, Bart vs. the Space Mutants, The Lone Ranger, Where's Waldo, American Gladiators, MC Kids. Actually, I might move MC Kids up the list because it's a pretty fun game. We've got NES Open Tournament Golf. Those are all 1991 games. And then the last NES game we're going to see from 1993, Kirby's Adventure. So, that was Tecmo Super Bowl. Hope you enjoyed the game. I'll see you in the next video, which I think is going to be MC Kids. Probably go ahead and move that up to the top.